She didn't go flying, which is a relief after what we saw this morning. If it had happened again, then she really would have been in trouble. But she escaped any sort of injury, and these dark horses have come up with another arresting performance. Sara sizing up the synchronicity challenge with two single inside right twizzles. Catching criminals is always difficult, but Hamish got a solid grip there. And this was the one, the move they called the blade banger. Hamish said it would look sick, but did they make it look easy or leave our judges feeling queasy? Jason. 7.5. Ashley. 7.5. Jane. 7. Chris. 8. It's a grand total of 30 out of 40. So a 30 out of 40. I mean, really, the way you come back out of these falls in rehearsals and just deliver a performance like that, you call yourself Team No Fear for yeah. very good reason. Yeah. Team No Fear. Yeah. <laughs> how, how was that for you tonight? Oh, this was better, but the, the morning was awful. Yeah. It was awful. I've been so nervous throughout the whole day and just been like, oh, Hamish, please, let's do it. But we made it. We did, did it. We did. We did. did. Yeah. 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 We've never seen that one before. No, blade yeah. banger. Yeah, right, OK, let's see what the judges have to say. Seven. Jane, what's going on? Yeah, for me, um, well, well done for coming out after that bad fall. Um, well done for that. But for me, um, when you were skating on your own, I've seen you skate faster and with more attack. So the times when you were on your own, I felt there was a lack of speed. And also the... Um, <laughs> And also in the step sequence, we only had the one twizzle, but um, a lot of the other steps you were out of sync with each other, so that brought my mark down. Oh, okay. So a seven there from Jane, but an eight from Chris. Well, clearly I've got the right mark. <laughs> <laughs> you made it to 35 years and then that was it. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> I love the performance quality. You go out there every time and give it 100%, no matter what's happening. And that's what I admire, um, the performance. But also, the speed over the ice, I, I'm liking the speed over the ice. I'm liking your relationship with each other and that you keep pushing each other. You try new things. Mm. I w I'm not saying I'm a big fan of that last lift, <laughs> I, to be honest. But you're Why? trying something Why? new. You have to try something new. Well, um, Why don't you like it? Well, Sara doesn't have to do anything. She just lies back and enjoys the ride. Oh, my goodness! <laughs> she has to be very she brave. Does. She has to be so no, brave. She has to be brave. It's all in his feet. I've been crying the whole day because I've been so I nervous know. about I'm it. Head. I thought you were a very brave lady. Uh, uh, Jason. Well, I mean, you know, not to be as misogynistic as this, <laughs> but um, I, what I, I do like about this couple is that you are fully committed when you're out there. Yeah. What I didn't like about this, though, is choreographically, I felt that this was not your strongest week. Given that you always push the envelope, Hamish, with, with what you do, but the problem is, today, you really made it just very basic, very easy. You could have had more cat and mouse play with the story that you were telling, and I do have to agree with Chris. That end lift looked like you were swinging around a zebra crossing. 